hey everyone welcome back to my channel so today i thought i would do another grocery haul uh i just got back from out of town uh this past weekend i went to minneapolis and the weekend before that we were in chicago so our refrigerator is a little bit all over the place we got a little bit of this but not enough of that so i need to go and just kind of do a replenish of our like staple things uh the freezer is good i don't need to really get a lot of like frozen stuff but we do need like salad vegetables and stuff like that so i did use the um notes app in my iphone uh one of you all suggested that i do that and i always forget to do that and that's actually really smart because i buy the same stuff <laughs> every week or every other week so that's a great way for me to like save my grocery list and not have to like write down everything all over again because i end up tossing the paper that i write on uh so thank you for that because i always forget to use the notes section for a grocery list i use it for other things but i never use it for a grocery list so that's what i'm going to be using today uh i did just do a quick inventory check just to see what all i needed to pick up so i can kind of make the grocery trip very easy because i will be taking my son with me and sometimes that can get a little chaotic that's what i'm gonna do i'm about to finish my coffee first and then pick up the house a little bit and then we'll head to target and whole foods is where i'm going to be going you guys know i mentioned before that's pretty much where i go and get my groceries from i do use the prime app at um whole foods and then i use my cartwheel app at target so yeah that's what i'm going to be sharing with you guys today and we'll go to the stores and then when i come back i'll do a haul and share everything with you guys all right guys quick ootd before i head out just wearing my gray joggers from target white bodysuit tevas uh, my silver antagona and then I have my jean jacket because i get cold uh, Sunnies are from Amazon. If I can find them, I'll link them. I think they're back in stock, but I'll double check for you guys. Um, same necklaces that I always wear, my initial necklaces and my name necklace here. And yeah, this is my grocery store OOTD. guys so i am back from the grocery store and i'm gonna start with the things that i got from whole foods first i got some flow waters here they were 99 cent each i got two pieces of salmon some mixed vegetables some vitamins usually get these from target but target was out of them but they were on sale at whole foods raisin bread a little frozen passion fruit bites here i got these uh, sprouted original crackers i got lesser evil <laughs> lesser evil popcorn I got this salad kit. This is the sweet kale. I just got it for the mix. I'm not going to use the stuff that comes in it. I'm just going to use the, um, you know, mix. I got some ranch dressing, blueberries, nectarines, yogurt, and some overpriced cherries. Lastly, from Whole Foods, I got some uh, organic mild Italian chicken sausage. This is my favorite chicken sausage. It's really good for breakfast for lunch or for dinner. An onion, green and red pepper, um, mushroom. Uh, I got two lemons, two kiwis for Sefton. I got Sefton some bananas. I don't eat bananas. Got some organic grapes. And then I picked up this um, Skinny Pop mini rice cakes. Only 60 calories per 10 cakes. So I decided to go with these instead of my um, regular like whole rice cakes that i usually get just because the calories on this is a lot less 
than the ones that I usually get, but got those at Whole Foods as well. Now with Target, I did buy some non-food items. So I did spend a little bit more there. So I picked up a thing of eggs, some bread. I got this uh, cranberry and pecan mix. I'm gonna use for my salad, this uh, brown rice, cause Hefton really likes rice. Up uh, Two things of dried mangoes for Sefton. Some chicken meatballs by the brand Kid Fresh. Picked up me some sweet potato fries, Diet Coke. Found this new creamer. It's a non-dairy almond milk and oat milk caramel macchiato. So I'm super excited to try that. Got Sefton some uh, s'mores granola bar. Got him some fruit snack. Got him some brownie little bites. Some goldfish crackers. I picked up another thing of Method dish soap. Got another thing of vitamin C gummies for myself. Picked up some Dial antibacterial soap because PK has this soap at uh, his house and I really like this. Picked up a thing of Dove um, foaming body wash. This is something new that I'm trying. Um, one of my friends on Instagram and here on my YouTube channel who originally told me about this Sweet Chef brand sent me a message on Instagram and told me that they had a cleanser. So um, I told her I was gonna grab one. She said it was hard to find in Target, but my Target seemed to have a lot of them in stock. So I was excited about that. So I'm going to try that out. I picked up another thing of my Honey Pot Feminine Wash. Picked up the Honey Pot Wipes. Got some uh, string cheese for Sefton. Got some pepper jack cheese for myself. Got classic mild cheddar for Sefton grilled cheese sandwiches. Thing of Aluminum foil. Anybody else say aluminum foil like that? Aluminum foil? Or do y'all just say Reynolds wrap? <laughs> I picked up two of these two good mango yogurts to try out to see how I like them because we love mangoes here. So I got one for me and one for Seth. I already have some vanilla ones in the refrigerator. So I told him we'll get one of each and see how we like them. If we like them, we'll get some more. And I think that's it. So yeah guys, this is my weekly grocery haul. All right, I almost forgot because I know you guys like to see prices. This is the Whole Foods receipt. I spent $82.64, uh, but I used my Prime and got an extra 10% off. So I saved a total of $10.40. And on the Target, I spent $111.99, used my cartwheel. So that is everything that I wanted to share with you. I hope you guys found this video helpful. I actually like watching grocery hauls. They're kind of like fun to see what other people buy. Um, I get recipe ideas as well. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, just list them below. Don't forget to subscribe and I will catch you in the next one. Bye.